Shaker Girls soccer team really likes the fact that they didn't make the top five power rankings that came out earlier this week. First year coach here, um, very, very well. I see a lot of good stuff. Um, we have a lot of returning seniors. Um, we got a lot of young blood coming up. Um, so I think we're gonna have a very, very solid year. Uh, TU has us as a sixth seed coming in. We'll be the dark horse. I mean, we played well as a team. Um, we're working together. I think this year we're going to come out really strong. We have, we're have we good through defense, through offense. It's going to be a great season. We're really excited. We played well at the this, this scrimmages, and we're ready to go into our season, win lots of games. Playing in the Suburban Council is a challenge that these new dark horse Bisons are looking forward to with a new mindset this season. The season's going really well. We all get along. There's no drama or anything on this team. So there's been really good in comparison to last year's. I think everyone's really in shape, so that's helping out a lot so that we can focus on the soccer and less about the running. <laughs> Some newcomers we should be looking out for is uh, Kate Sepian. Uh, she's center mid. Uh, Julia Lennon, she's going to be a uh, striker. Some of the returning seniors um, with the leadership, Justine Tiger, uh, Steph Church, Caitlin Chaney, uh, Erica Valacorsa. We're going to be a 2 nothing kind of team. We're, we're not looking to pile on the goals. We're looking to have some nice team play, strong D, uh, not, a lot of, not allowing a lot of goals back. We're going to play a lot of three back, flat back three, three, four, three, change up four, four, two, all that stuff. Mm -hmm. This is Ben Myers for timesunion.com and the Sidelines blog.